Bible says the most high is sovereign over the kingdom of men. I chose you out of the world. Therefore, the world will hate you. Sanctification is the gradual process by which a believing Christian is made holy through the Holy Spirit. The supernatural is what makes Christianity much more than a mere religion. For a sanctified life is indispensable for a Christian if he or she wants to be in good relationship with God and grow in grace. Religion plus education, yes, that is education in totality. For your child to have a taste of modern world, he or she must grab knowledge from a great citadel of learning. Oshita Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ogere Remo, the Church of the Lord, Aladura College, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, Aladura Comprehensive High School, and Tony Village, Lagos, Reverend Emmanuel Oyedelia Shamun, Nursery and Primary School, and Tony Village, Lagos, Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, and Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Antony Village, Lagos, Nigeria. We have conducive learning environment, qualified and experienced teachers, computer education, career counseling, science laboratory, and lots more. Admission is in progress at Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School. The Church of the Lord, Aladra College, Ogere Remo, Aladra Comprehensive High School, Antony Village, Reverend Emmanuel Oyedele Ashamu, Nursery and Primary School, Antony Village, Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Antony Village, Lagos. For details, contact the Church of the Lord, Aladra Worldwide, Ogere Spiritual and International Headquarter, 10 to 12 Primate Oshitelu Street, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, Nigeria. P.O. Box 71 Shagamu, Ogun State, Nigeria. You can also call these phone numbers for any information. <laughs> Aladura Group of Schools cater for the yearnings of modern education. Viewers, listeners from all over the world, we welcome you to the voice of victory coming on to you from the Church of the Lord International Headquarters, Ogiri, Ogu State, Nigeria. And as you continue to listen to this message, the Lord will continue to bless you richly in Jesus' name. The theme of this message is divine progress. Supernatural progress. Which I tag progress God's way. Progress without regret. Our test can be found in the book of Philippians chapter 3 verses 12 to 14 and 1 Timothy chapter 4 verses 7 to 15. Let us bow our heads for prayer. Lord Almighty Jehovah, we thank you for this wonderful day. A day that you have made that we may feed at your feet. A day that we may listen to your word and put it into practice. Father, I beseech thee, grant unto your people listening ears and discerning hearts that your word may be profitable unto them and bear good fruits in them that at the end of their sojourn in this sinful world that your word may not stand against any of them. May the words of my mouth 
and the meditation of my heart, they are settable in the sight, my Lord and my Redeemer, even now and forevermore. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. Supernatural progress. Progress God's way. Progress without regret. People of God, whether Satan likes it or not, whether his agents like it or not, divine progress shall be your portion in the mighty name of Jesus. Philippians chapter 3 verse 12 to 14 reads, Not that I have now attained this ideal, or have already been made perfect, but I press on to lay hold of, of and make my own, that for which Christ Jesus the Messiah has laid hold of me and made me his own. I do not consider, beloved, that I have captured and made it my own yet, but one thing I do, my, by one aspiration, forgetting what lies behind and straining forward to what lies ahead. I press on toward the goal to win the supreme and heavenly prize to which God in Christ Jesus is calling us upward. Okay. Ara emi ko kara mi si eni ti owo ore ti te na sugbon o nkan yi le mi nse emi ngba gbe awon nkan ti o wa leyin mo si na ga wo awon nkan ti o wa di waju ese ikenu la emi le pa lati de opin ire ije ni fun ere ipe giga olorun ninu christ jesu that last verse verse 14 of Philippians, Philippians chapter 3 verse 14. I press on toward the goal to win the supreme and heavenly prize to which God in Christ is calling every one of us upward. In like manner, back on First Timothy chapter 4 verse 7 to 15. Read, but refuse and avoid irrelevant legends, profane and impure and godless fictions, mere grandmother's tales and silly myths, and express your disapproval of them. Train yourself toward godliness, keeping yourself spiritually fit. We take it uh, verse by verse, verse 7. First Timothy chapter 4, verse 7. Iwe Timothy kini ori kene, ese ikeje yupe, suban, ko oro asan, ko oro asan, ati itan awan agba omene, si ma to ala ale, si iwa bi olono. Verse 8. Ese ikeje For physical training is of some value, thus useful for a little, but godliness, spiritual training, is useful and of value in everything and in every way for it whole promise for the present life and also for the life which is to come. Verse 9. This saying is reliable and worthy of complete acceptance by everybody. Verse 10. With a view to this, we toil and strive, yes, and suffer reproach because we have feast our hope on the living God, who is the Savior, the preserver, the maintainer, the deliverer of all men, especially of those who believe, trust in, rely on, and adhere to him. Verse 11. 
pelu pelu ti awon ti o gbagbo verse 11 ese ikokanla continue to command these things and to teach them un kan won ye ni ki o ma pa lase ki o si ma ko ni verse 12 let no one despise you or think less of you because of your youth, but be an example and a pattern for the believers in speech, in conduct, in love, in faith, and in purity. Verse 13. Till I come, devote yourself to public and private reading, to exhortation, preaching, and personal appeals, and to the teaching and instilling the doctrine of God. Verse 14. Do not neglect the gift which is in you. That special inward endowment which was directly imparted to you by the Holy Spirit by prophetic utterance when the elders laid their hands upon you at your consecration. Verse 15, the last but not the least. Practice and cultivate and meditate upon these duties. Throw yourself wholly into them as your ministry so that your progress may be evident to everybody. Religion plus education. Yes, that is education in totality. For your child to have a taste of modern world, he or she must grab knowledge from a great citadel of learning. Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ogere Remo. The Church of the Lord, Aladura College, Ogere Remo, Ogun State. Aladura Comprehensive High School, Antony Village, Lagos. Reverend Emmanuel Oyedelia Shamu, Nursery and Primary School, Antony Village, Lagos. Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, and Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Antony Village, Lagos, Nigeria. We have conducive learning environment, qualified and experienced teachers, computer education, career counseling, science laboratory, and lots more. Admission is in progress at Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School. The Church of the Lord, Aladra College, Ogere Remo, Aladra Comprehensive High School, Antony Village, Reverend Emmanuel Oyedele Ashamu, Nursery and Primary School, Antony Village, Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Antony Village, Lagos. For details, contact the Church of the Lord, Aladra Worldwide, Ogere Spiritual and International Headquarter, 10 to 12, Primate Oshitelu Street, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, Nigeria. P.O. Box 71, Shagam, Ogun State, Nigeria. You can also call these phone numbers for any information. <laughs> Aladura Group of Schools cater for the yearnings of modern education. People of God, what is progress? Progress may be defined as improvement or advance toward perfection or improvement to a higher or a better state toward completion. Divine or supernatural is that which comes from above. So, therefore, now we combine the two words, divine progress or supernatural progress, however, is the improvement toward a higher and a better state through supernatural enablement. Lati okay, one time, Lati of the Lord, one, near ye, 
ti a le si apopo re pelu ilo siwaju lati odo olorun wi pe ilo siwaju ti ki se lati owo eniyan bi ko se wi pe olorun ti kara re ti se to re lati opiwa people of god eyin eniyan olorun to make progress in the way of god or in god's way lati ni ilo siwaju nipa ti olorun tabi lona olorun which does not bring regret ti ko si mo aba ma lowo you also have to do things god's way for there is progress in the way of the world which is shortcut which brings regret at the end of the day but there is also divine progress supernatural progress that brings special thanksgiving and testimonies without regret let us remember what the Bible says. The Bible says there is a way that seems right to a person. But the end is the way of destruction. Proverbs chapter 14, verse 12. People of God, the way of Satan and his agents may seem right and may even offer shortcut to prosperity and bad progress, but at the end of the day, it only produces temporary, unholy progress and eventually leads to destruction. Beloved in Christ, such are easy choices which do not require moral restraint, holiness, or obedience to the word of God. It does not require obedience to the word of God, courage, and godly lifestyle. Therefore, I urge you, do not be enticed by apparent short cause that seems right, but end in destruction. The word of God is sure when we apply it in the right way. I declare unto your lives today that you will enjoy divine progress in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. This reminds me of a story. The story of a man walking down a residential estate. And he noticed another man struggling with a washing machine at the doorway, at the entrance of a, a house. The man walking down the estate volunteered to help, but the landlord was overjoyed, and to, and to him, they both struggle with the washing machine. But, but after several minutes of fruitless effort, the two of them stopped and stared at each other, looked at each other. They were looking at each other in frustration. They were totally exhausted because they have tried to carry this washing machine inside the house and they could not. 
ero ifoso yi wole sugbon won o le se won wa ni idakule won wo ra won loju after cashing their breast lai igba ti ati wa mi kan le dada the stranger said to the landlord eni to rin bo lati ta yi wa wo baba onile we will never get this machine in there and the landlord replied why in i'm trying to move the machine out here i was not trying to move it in i want to move it out what the the man who was walking by the street who offered to help thought they want to move the machine in so as the two of them were struggling he was trying to move the machine in the landlord was trying to move the machine out naturally they did not succeed. Baba, only left here and now. Lowo, any time now, Baba, only the lowo. Ongu yandu lati na Baba, lowo lati be ero yuwale. Baba, only left ongu yandu lati be sita. Nibi ati amete diwa sini. Baba, iwa wifu wipe. Baba, only in lowo iwa sofu la lowo wipe. Ako ni le be wale. Subo Baba only le ofi tarada o wipe. Eh, sheki no data feng be wale. Ongu yandu ati be sita ni. Ashe, i she ni Baba ni be sita. There are a lot of lessons we can learn from this story. Even sometimes while we are trying to help, without asking the person that needed the help, what is it that you want me to do for you? The Bible tells us many times when Jesus was going around very compassionately helping people, doing good to people. And when he sees a, a blind man, he will ask him, what do you want me to do for you? Because he did not want to do like this man walking by the road who just offered to help without knowing the type of help is needed. So, they, they will talk with their mouth that I may see and Jesus will tell them your faith has healed you. I want to just about be there when you want to down or can you know what's it be? Yeah, make your own name. Yes, who has it down alone? We pay key by boy, you kill me. Larada. So, if the man that was walking down the estate had asked the landlord, What do you want me to do for you? What help can I render unto you? T. I want to tell you, I love you. 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 But without asking, it just took for granted. Many, many times, many of us, we assume, oh, this is the type of help somebody needs, and we give the wrong help. People of God, you will call on the name of the Lord and the Lord shall answer you. And he will grant you all your heart desires in the mighty name of Jesus. He will be with you in trouble. He will deliver you and honor you. He will satisfy you with long life and prosperity and show you his salvation in Christ Jesus. May all this be your portion in the mighty name of Jesus. Beloved, viewers and listeners all over the world, the numbers that you are seeing on your screen, please you can call them for special prayers. You can call them for counseling. You can also call them to share your testimonies with us. And as you continue to listen to the word of God and as you continue to abide in them, the Lord will continue to bless you beyond your expectations. And it shall be well with you. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. 
See you next week. Same station, same channel. Same day, same time. Until then, remain blessed. In Jesus' name. God bless you. Bye-bye. It is well. Religion plus education. Yes, that is education in totality. For your child to have a taste of modern world, he or she must grab knowledge from a great citadel of learning. Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ogere Remo. The Church of the Lord, Aladura College, Ogere Remo, Ogun State. Aladura Comprehensive High School, Antony Village, Lagos. Reverend Emmanuel Oyedelia Shamu, Nursery and Primary School, Antony Village, Lagos. Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, and Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Antony Village, Lagos, Nigeria. We have conducive learning environment, qualified and experienced teachers, computer education, career counseling, science laboratory, and lots more. Admission is in progress at Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School. The Church of the Lord, Aladra College, Ogere Remo, Aladra Comprehensive High School, Antony Village, Reverend Emmanuel Oyedele Ashamu, Nursery and Primary School, Antony Village, Oshitelu Memorial Nursery and Primary School, Ayede Ekiti, Aladra Theological Institute, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, and Antony Village, Lagos. For details, contact the Church of the Lord, Aladra Worldwide, Ogere Spiritual and International Headquarter, 10 to 12 Primate Oshitelu Street, Ogere Remo, Ogun State, Nigeria. P.O. Box 71 Shagamu, Ogun State, Nigeria. You can also call these phone numbers for any information. <laughs> Aladura Group of Schools cater for the yearnings of modern education.